front is crossing the local area. Temperatures this afternoon reached a high of 60. That's cooler than yesterday when we were in the 70s. This morning we started off at 52 degrees, nine hundredths of an inch of rainfall with that front, and we're looking at a tenth of an inch. That's it. Month to date total. We'll add more precipitation to that likely tomorrow. For now, mostly cloudy, but the rain has exited as we check out the live view along I-75. Winds picking up back to the west, gusting upwards of 20 to 30 miles per hour, and it's going to be breezy tonight and really for the next couple of days as we check out temperatures. They're in the process of falling back. Now 59 in Lima, down into the mid-50s as we look to the north and west as that cold front is pushing eastward. Checking out the radar and satellite composite. The rain for the most part off to the east, still lots of lingering cloud cover. That cold front will go through. We're going to cool off considerably tonight with that breeze. Then an upper level disturbance back to the north and west is generating flurries along the international border and we will likely see some flurries here tomorrow. There's even the chance of a briefly heavier snow shower, which could coat the ground in some places briefly. Doesn't look like a big deal, but the chance for a thin slushy accumulation of snow in spots tomorrow and tomorrow night. Mostly cloudy skies through this evening. Late tonight, clouds will be around from time to time. Cloud cover tomorrow morning, and then with that weak disturbance moving in, check it out. The blue on the map showing those snow showers and flurries by 11 o'clock and midday. Snow showers off and on tomorrow afternoon. Scattered flurries for tomorrow night, and we'll hold on to that risk for Sunday morning. A few flurries early on, then clouds and eventually some peaks of sunshine Sunday afternoon. Even with a little bit of sunshine, it's still going to be quite a bit colder than we've gotten used to in recent days. Snowfall, the chance for a thin slushy coating again tomorrow and tomorrow night. Not everyone will see that, but that chance is there as a heads up. As we check out temperatures later this evening, 9 p.m. down into the 40s already. By daybreak tomorrow, just a little bit above freezing. Mid-30s for most of us. Temperatures tomorrow afternoon not moving much. By 1 p.m., 37 Van Wert, 36 Salina, 39 degrees in Lima. With the wind chill tomorrow, it's going to feel like it's around freezing even into the afternoon. So as we check out those wind chill temperatures, look at this. By 1 p.m., 30 degrees tomorrow with Lima, wind chill of 29 for Van Wert. Forecast for tonight, mostly cloudy as it turns breezy and colder, 33 degrees by daybreak. During the day tomorrow, clouds with some snow showers and flurries. Again, that chance of a minor thin slushy accumulation in some places on the grass and trees, 39 is what we expect for a high. Seven-day storm authority forecast for Sunday, early flurries and clouds. Afternoon peaks of sunshine, a high of 39 degrees. 40 degrees, partly cloudy on Monday. The chance of snow, ice, and rain on Tuesday, upper 30s. We're back to 40 with scattered flurries for Wednesday. Chilly temperatures prevail Thursday and Friday, upper 30s to near 40 with a mix of sun and clouds. Overnight lows in the 20s. So wintry weather is on the way.